Using voice commands to control your home is the wave of the future. I show you how you can do it today with the Ecobee 3 Smart Thermostat. Stay tuned. The Ecobee 3 is a smart thermostat that connects to your home Wi-Fi network, allowing you to control the temperature from anywhere that you have an internet connection. This isn't new, as there are a few other devices out there that do the same thing. However, what sets the Ecobee 3 apart is that it has built-in support for Apple HomeKit as well as Amazon's Alexa. This means you can control the Ecobee 3 thermostat with your voice by using Siri with an iPhone, iPad, Apple Watch, or iPod Touch, or an Alexa-enabled device like the Amazon Echo, Echo Dot, or Amazon Tap. And with Father's Day around the corner, this is one you might want to pay close attention to because it's that good. Inside the box, you'll find the Ecobee thermostat itself, along with one room sensor with detachable stand. Aside from HomeKit capability, this is another area where the Ecobee stands out. The sensor is placed in the room that's separate from where the thermostat is placed, allowing the system to monitor temperature and motion in more than one place. So if your thermostat is on the first floor, but you spend a lot of time on the second floor, the Ecobee will still know that you're home and it'll keep the temperature right where it should be. Alternatively, it will also save you money when you aren't home by optimizing the temperature accordingly rather than wasting your resources and cash. You get one sensor in the box as I mentioned, but you can have up to 32 of these sensors in your home if you're a straight up baller. You'll also find the power extender kit, screws and drywall plugs, standard and large trim plates, a quick start guide, installation guide, wire label stickers, and some Ecobee logo stickers inside the box as well. Ecobee says it takes about 45 minutes to install, but I was actually up and running in about 20 minutes, and again, I'm no handyman. First thing you want to do is get rid of whatever crappy thermostat you're currently using, and then label your wires if they aren't already. Mine were already labeled from when I originally installed my older Nest thermostat, so I was able to save that step. Then you choose the trim plate that's applicable to you, and screw it in place. The Ecobee backplate has a built-in level, which is nice, so you know that you're orienting everything the way it should be. From there, you plug the wires for your system into the corresponding holes. Again, keeping the wires labeled makes this a snap. I got everything plugged in, pushed the wires back into the wall, and then connected the Ecobee thermostat, which just snapped right into place without much force. At this point, installation is done, and it's time to turn the power back on, which will start the boot up process. The touchscreen interface is nice and it walks you through setup in a nice intuitive way. During the process, you are invited to download the Ecobee 3 app, which mirrors the interface of the display, making it super easy to control from afar. You also get the option of using your iOS device to quickly get the Ecobee 3 set up on your Wi-Fi network, as well as getting HomeKit set up as well so that you can control the thermostat with Siri. Both of these just add to the convenience of setup, which makes a novice like me feel like I know exactly what I'm doing when I'm installing hardware on my wall, which I don't. Once everything is up and running, you're then able to control the Ecobee 3 in a few ways. First, directly from the built-in touchscreen. When you approach it, the Ecobee 3 changes from the view-only interface into the interactive one, which is cool. Changing the temperature is as easy as sliding your finger up and down the right side of the display. You can also get a weather forecast right on the Ecobee 3 as well, and of course, you can change the settings too. You can also use a smartphone app to control the thermostat, which can be downloaded from the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store for Android. Finally, you've got voice control, which is the most convenient especially when it's hands-free. For example, you can use Siri with the Hey Siri command. Set my home temperature to 73 degrees. You got it, Andrew. I set the home to about 70. Or you can use an Alexa-enabled device like the Amazon Echo. Alexa, set the home temperature to 75 degrees. Setting home AC to 75. This is where most of the appeal lies for me, and having both Siri and Alexa voice control is something that no other smart thermostat to date can do. As someone who's been building my smart home around devices that can take advantage of both HomeKit and Alexa, the Ecobee 3 is the perfect smart thermostat for my home thanks to that flexibility. If you're in the market for a smart thermostat that allows you to interface with it in multiple ways from connected devices, I think the Ecobee 3 is the one to get.
Now I want to know what you think. Have you started buying devices to make your home a bit smarter? Leave a comment below letting me know what you've outfitted your home with or if you're still waiting for the market to develop. If you like what you saw here and are feeling the Ecobee 3, do me a favor and hit that like button. And if you loved it, be sure to hit the subscribe button as well if you haven't already in order to stay notified of future tech reviews, tutorials, first looks, and more right here from this channel. Big shout out to Ecobee for sending this one over. And if you want to see more on the Ecobee 3, be sure to check out my dream team brethren as we all took the Ecobee 3 for a spin. I'll leave a link to the playlist where you can check out all the videos in the description below. Thanks for watching. As always, guys, your support is greatly appreciated. Until next time, I'm Andrew Edwards, and I'll catch you in the next video.